Makarosu $82.99. Thank you to Owen for paying. Man, yeah, shut up. It's just McDonald's, bro. Nah, it's the thought that counts. I mean, hey, it's not every day my boy gets into med school. Thanks, man. Yo, well, how's everyone doing? I mean, you know, same shit every week. I got a dead end job that I hate, and I haven't been able to go work out, so I just feel like shit all the time. At least your ass is getting paid. I had to work overtime three fucking nights this week, bro. Yo, I took a shit for now. My boss didn't even notice what I did for him. It is what it is. Real talk though for a second, the McRib is quite possibly the stupidest item at McDonald's. No, like, don't get me wrong. No, no. Like, like, don't, don't, don't get me wrong. It's a genius way to drive high. But like, why not do it for a decent sandwich? Nah, I disagree. The shamrock shake is actually the worst item. It honestly just tastes like toothpaste. You are so fucking stupid. The shamrock shake is the greatest invention ever made in humankind. First of all, what are you even doing getting ice cream at McDonald's? The machine is always broken. And there's an ice cream place right down the street. First response is so invalid. You got two cheeseburgers thinking it was a good deal instead of just getting a regular big knife. Also, the shamrock shake is so fucking good. Nah, y'all are a bunch of goodness for real though. But like the worst meal on the McDonald's menu has to be, I think the fish filet because like, who the fuck puts cheese on fish? I, but you're not hearing me out. Like, one time I got a fish filet and it was not even cooked with. <laughs> That shit is actually disgusting. Oh, shit, I gotta take this. Oh my Bro, goodness, Bro, the fish brother. full ice sucks. <laughs> I like the Big Macs though. The Big Macs are really good. I have some Yeah, this is Owen Sunderland. Can I help you? Oh uh, yeah, this is Stephen Miller from uh, Ocelot Parks, and uh, we were trying to get you in for an interview soon. Oh, actually, the... That'd be awesome. Does uh, 12 this Monday work? Yeah, no, yeah, 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 that'd be great. All right, well, we'll see you then. Oh, I'll see you then, thank you. What the fuck? Oh, finally, nice to meet you. Same with you. Have a seat. So, why do you think this will be a good fit for you? Well, uh, I've really been... Honestly, I don't even care. You obviously look like you qualify for this job. Just tell me a little bit more about you. I, um, I, I've been really busy with this new job that I've been uh, working at. Oh, I play guitar. I like to spend time with my friends. Yeah. Tell me something I've never heard. There was this one time in Canada, uh, this one trip, uh, we were down in Quetico, and uh, there was this crazy storm, and that was like the first time for the whole trip we had ever started like writing, like genuinely. Oh, well, look at the time. Uh, I can't guarantee anything, but I think you'll be great for this. Job. Oh God, thank you so much. Oh, shoot, I almost forgot to tell you that the headquarters is actually located in Seattle. that this group can continue without you. But more importantly, they're not gonna be stuck in this hole forever. And neither should you. This group is all I care about. But it doesn't have to be. This is what you wanna do, right? Yeah. But who gives a fuck? It's a 
in the right location. I can do that. Take care of yourself, bro. Better take that job, though. Call me crazy, but I think I'm being followed. What? Yeah, like I, I don't know. I've I just I, I've seen someone like following me and like recording me like at the McDonald's and at my interview. Wow, I had no idea. I never seen anything like that before when we were there. I don't know. It's just like I, I see them wherever I go. Uh, uh, what do you want to tell me though? Now you're gonna call me crazy. I'm moving to Detroit. <laughs> what? Why? It's Jane, bro. Like. Like she, she's got to move to like to get close to her family right now and you know, I, I got to go to support her. But you two have only been dating for two months. I know, but it's not just that. I don't really have anything left in this town, you know? I got to move and start a new chapter of my life. How was your interview anyway? I, I don't know. I think they're going to go a, another way. Damn. I, yeah. It, anyways. So, when are you, uh, when are you moving? A couple days, yo. When do you pack? I gotta pack right now. I'll get you later. Uh, I'm sorry to not do this in person, but I'm worried if I did, you would try to get me to stay. And I can't do that to Zach. Me and Zach found someone who would fund our band and found us people to fill it out. But we have to leave tonight to fill in for a show. I'm really gonna miss you, man, but I need to take this chance, and so do you. You're stuck here. You're so wrapped up in what you might lose that you forget to think about what you might gain. I know for a fact you chose not to take that job. I love you, man, but you're gonna get out of your own head and get the fuck out of here. Come to visit if you have the chance, please. Nothing is as it has been 
And I miss your face like hell And I guess it's just as well But I miss your face like hell Been talking about the way things change And my family lives in a different state And if you don't know what to make of this Then we will not relate so if you don't know what to make